we we will not have any, and that is if in case we have a, an emergency such as a uh, substantial earthquake where water is turned off or the water has been uh, contaminated, uh, we, we have a real problem at that point and uh, sometimes our power is turned off. So I went out and bought an IBC tote and uh, began to prepare it and this video is about that preparation and what I did to prepare myself for an emergency that would come up. First of all, I made sure that it was a food grade quality uh, IBC tote. And the second thing is I needed to prepare it and cleaning it out. And I, IBC tote is very translucent. So it allows sunlight to go through. So I wanted to be able to spray paint that uh, using a black primer. There are specific types of uh, paints out there that will adhere to uh, plastic so I bought that. So I used the white paint to uh, be reflective and keep the temperatures cooler. Putting the, um, the parts together was not difficult, it's a matter of using the primer to get the plastic, the PVC plastic to adhere to each other. This allowed me to then put on the glue and be able to fit it together and, and making sure that it was tight so uh, we could make sure that there's no leaks there. Then it was just a matter of going over to the tank and then uh, putting the Teflon tape onto the, the threads of the uh, drain. After I completed the uh, gluing of the PVC parts together, I ended up going over and as you can see I'm uh, putting on the adapter, uh, the glued adapter over onto the IPC tote. After I uh, did this I was able to put on Teflon tape onto the three quarter inch uh, extender uh, on both ends, uh, attach the um, quarter turn uh, ball valve then after this, the, I, I, I went ahead and put uh, the a ball valve onto the adapter and making sure it is nicely hand tight and uh, this would allow uh, no leakage at this point. Uh, after I completed this, I wanted to be able to test to see if there were any leaks. So I again opened up the valve to the IPC tote and then turned the uh, quarter turn to open up the valve to see whether or not uh, there, the leakage would, would happen and as I can see that there is no water leakage. up and, and I've let it sit there for a couple weeks and I want to test the water. 